Welcome back to StarCraft Remastered. This is the Zerg Campaign, Episode 6, uh, Second Mission, Reign of Fire. The side disruptor is causing me some very serious problems. Although I've regained control of my forces here, it's taking more and more concentration just to keep them in line. Oh, my heart's breaking for you, Kerrigan. Now exactly why was it that you asked Phoenix and I to bring Minx to you? Are you still suspicious that I'll kill him for abandoning me to the Zerg? I've gotten over it, Jim. We can't afford to let petty hatreds jeopardize our plans for the UED. That's reassuring. Arcturus, I presume you found your cold sleep chamber accommodating? What is the meaning of this, Kerrigan? Straight to the point, huh? I was hoping to chat. It's been a while. Not long enough. Why have I been brought here? I need your psi emitters, Arcturus. Why? Remember the Confederate psi disruptor that you could never find? Well, the UED found it, and it's preventing me from controlling my minions. With the help of your psi emitters, I can gather up enough Zerg to destroy the disruptor and confront the UED. And what are you offering me in return? Ha! Ever the politician. All right, Emperor. If you help me destroy the Disruptor, I'll help you retake Korhal from the UED. Hmm, a tempting offer. What assurances do I have of you fulfilling your end of the bargain? The only thing I can assure you of, Arcturus, is that without my help, you'll be the Emperor of your own little 8x8 cell for the rest of your life. <sighs> I see that you're still a persuasive speaker. All right, Kerrigan. I'll lend you some emitters, but this had better be worth it. Okay, so let's begin this mission. All right, boys and girls, listen up. Our objective is to locate and disable the Psy Disruptor's primary power generator. Once we've done that, we'll turn over the mission to Mengsk and Kerrigan. Let's move out. I'm gone. CVs. With the disruptor's power cut, the emitter should be able to get the attention of any renegade Zerg near it. The SCV will then be able to lure the Zerg back to your base. Once the Zerg arrive there, you'll be able to assert direct control over them. Okay, so we've been given the uh, Psy emitter here. Once we get close to the Zergs, they should come under our control, uh, which means that we can um, start building a base now. I can construct a new hive cluster. Once my forces have grown strong enough, I can assault the Psy disruptor directly. Orders, Captain. Orders received. <laughs> And uh, let's just have a look around and see if there's any other troops around here. It doesn't look like it. we've got the uh, little zerglings here. It looks like they, they are just basic uh, basic zerglings. And I'm really going to have to wait for the hatchery to finish mutating before I can do anything else, unfortunately. I don't think we can start placing any other buildings, can we? No, we need the creep to have already begun. But let's uh, have a look down here and see if we can find any other zerglings. Oh, there's a few more there. Oh. oh, where are you going? Where are you going? Why are they running away? They're scared. I'm going to let him um, just chase the, the medic and see what he finds over there. 
like there's another marine heading down here as well. Uh, we've got some hydralists now, which is good. Although these Zerg are now under my control, I sense that there are more Zerg out there. We must lure as many of them here as possible. Uh, looks like these are special um, hydralisks here called uh, Hunter Killers. Um, right, there's a bunker over here. Let's see if we can take this out. I think there's a few more uh, Zerglings over here as well. Uh, so let's bring the uh, side Disruptor up here. Uh, okay, the hatchery is ready to go. Um, so before I can do anything else, I do need uh, some overlords. Uh, let's start gathering some minerals and then I'll build a, a vent and a simulator over here, I think it's called. And we've got some polar bears over here as well. Uh, Ursodons, I'm just going to leave them. Just going to leave them alone. They look quite, uh, quite friendly. Gosh, there is another bunker up there. Looks like there's a tank uh, up there as well. So I'm just going to avoid avoid heading up there for now. Oh, there's another bunker over there. I think I need more troops. I think I will need more troops. But uh, we've we've got a few of them so far. Let's just leave these guys here for now. I'm going to bring. I'm just going to leave him on the, uh, the the western side here. Should be fairly safe, I hope. Uh, I've got some overlords now. I'm just going to send them out. Uh, let's grab some more overlords as well. Uh, they can go and uh, scout out um, a little bit. And once these overlords are ready, I'll build some more drones. Uh, I will definitely need a second hatchery as well. Um, I don't have the minerals for a second hatchery, so let's just keep going with the minerals uh, first of all. It's going to be a little bit slow getting uh, started here. Let's go for the drones one by one. I could try and take out uh, this bunker here. I think there's a tank over there as well, so I wouldn't mind just um, having a few extra troops. Oh, there is another Hydralisk uh, over there. He needs to be uh, rescued. Another three of them. Hmm, I guess I could take out that bunker, couldn't I? I may lose a few of my troops here, but there are some more Hydralisks there. Ah, let's go and do it. Let's take out this bunker. Oh, there's a tank there as well. Could be trouble, could be trouble. Okay, it looks like um, we found a few more Hydralisks. Uh, some more Hunter Killers here. So that worked out uh, pretty well. Let's keep going for the minerals here. Uh, more drones. Yes, 
Let's just go and see what else we've got. Can I actually get across this uh, frozen lake? Oh, I can't. I can't. I can't get across. Oh, I can. There's a um. Uh, there's a ramp leading down to that frozen lake there. Okay, but there's another section over. Well, there's a bunker over here with another uh, another tank, I think. Um. So let's go and do that. I want to bring the SCV away and make sure he doesn't get attacked. But uh, we should be able to take out this bunker now. Uh, so let's go and do that quickly. I'm basically just waiting for the minerals. Oh! Oh, we've got an Ultralisk uh, here as well. Torresk, Torresk. Uh, he's a unique Ultralisk, has 800 health and uh, does 50 damage, uh, armor 4 plus 2. So he's an upgraded Ultralisk, that is absolutely amazing. Definitely want to have him on my side. Uh, with all due respect to Miss Kerrigan, sir, these critters make me nervous as hell. I sure would appreciate some immediate evac. Okay, so we're going to have to start building um, some of these, just uh, the basic buildings here. Let's go for a few more drones. Uh, there's an area up here I can expand to, but I just want to get this up and running first of all. Um, uh, we've got the, the spawning pool there. Um, oh, the second hatchery is what we need as well, but I still need, still need a few more minerals here, so let's just um, continue gathering. Okay, so finally I'm uh, mutating into a, an ex extractor up here so that we can start gathering the, uh, the gas as well. Um, we've got the Zerg spawning pool, so finally we can um, start morphing into some Zerglings here. Let's go and make a few of those. And um, I will grab a few more drones once this has mutated and build a second hatchery up here, or a third hatchery up here. Um, is, there's, there's more gas up here as well, so we should be pretty good for resources in this mission.
okay. Um, let's continue building these drones. I need to make a drone before I can make any of the other buildings, because that's uh, just what they mutate into. So we've got the, uh, the spawning pool. I need the uh, the hydrolysis den as well. Uh, so let's go and do that. Uh, I also need the uh, the evolution chamber. So let's go and make one of those down there. Um, let's go and grab a little bit more gas over here. I'm going to turn this into... Um, well, I want a spore colony over there. Let's make a, a few sunken colonies over here by the entrance as well. Um, there we go. And another creep colony maybe just there. Turn it into a sunken colony a little bit later. Uh, a couple of spore colonies around here. Uh, then we should be good to go. More drones. Um, and then we have the, the hatchery up here. Oh, we need to wait uh, now for 300 minerals before we can do that. Okay, so once I get the next um, hatchery up and running, hopefully we're going to be good for minerals for the rest of the game. Um, just waiting for 300 here. Almost there. There we go. Can evolve into a... How close can I get? That should be good. And then I can build an assimilator over here. Uh, extractor, I should say. Let's build an extractor over there. And this guy's just going to have to wait. Uh, I will need some defenses up there as well. Uh, we should be able to build the, uh, the hydrolysis now. Um, so, oh, let's go for the... Minerals. All right, we're going to have to wait. We are going to have to wait. It's a bit of a slow a slow start, this map. Uh, let's go with the a couple of sunken colonies just to protect this place here. Uh, I wouldn't mind um, just one more spore colony somewhere around here as well. Okay, it's almost there. Three, two, one, and ready to go. Okay, so let's start uh, building the drones over here. Um, start gathering minerals as well. And hopefully this is going to sort out our mineral uh, our resources here. Let's go and build some more drones. And maybe I can send them up just to get that going a little bit quicker. I don't think we have access to all of the, the buildings in this map, but we do have the Queen's Nest and the Spire as well um, for the Mutalisks. Let's grab these three, uh, send them up for the production up there. And start building the, uh, the Hydralisks as well. I guess I can set the rally point uh, somewhere over... Oops. Over here, start building up a little little army, and uh, then we're going to go and find out where the, uh, the the enemy is located. Now, are there any minerals over here? Is there a mineral patch on this side? Because I can probably send out another. Oh, there, there we go. There is another mineral patch over here. It looks like it's completely undefended as well. 
Um, so I could grab a couple of these and uh, send them over. The hive cluster is under attack. Oh god! It looks like they dropped off um, some troops there, so uh, unfortunately that wasn't upgraded, so I'm going to have to wait. Uh, let's go and make a few more drones here, build a few more buildings, hydralists over there as well. Need more resources. Uh, let's go and grab the drone, turn him into another... Oh god, come on, come on with the minerals! Okay, let's try that again. Another spore colony there. I don't know how they got up there. Oh, there we go. He's dropping them off. Right. Oh, I don't need another spore colony up there, don't I? Let's uh, do that. Let's go and build another spore colony. Shouldn't be able to do too much damage there. Alright, let's go and have a look. Um, see where the entrance to the enemy base is located. I think we need to head out uh, down this ramp here, actually. So let's go and start that. Let's go and build a few um, a few colonies uh, over here just to protect this base as well. Uh, just waiting for the hatchery here. Shouldn't be long. Okay, so I probably should be starting with the upgrades here as well. Increased Hydralisk attack range. I definitely want that one. Um, let's just get this up and running the Zerg hatchery over here. I do need to... Well, we've got some, some more drones. Oops, so let's get them gathering minerals over there. Oh god, oh that's screwed. Okay, there's nothing really I can do about that right now. Is this the beginning of the enemy's base? Oh, I think it is. I think this is the enemy's base here. Um, the side disruptor should be, should be up there somewhere. Alright, let's go and defend this base. Complete. 
Um, the evolution there has been complete. Faster hydrolysis movement. Um, let's start making some hydrolysis over here. They're trying to kill that egg. Okay. Be able to take them down. One of them. The egg did hatch. Beautiful. Do need more overlords, okay. So let's build a few more overlords over here as well. Build more overlords, right. And I do need uh, a few more drones over here now as well because uh, they were destroyed, unfortunately. So uh, let's go and build. Uh, I need more overlords, okay. I'm still waiting for the overlords. Now, I'm just going to rebuild that hatchery uh, over here. Looks like this is where they're sending out most of their attacks, and I think this is one of the entrances um, to the enemy base. Um, so this is probably a good spot to um, just to set up our army. Let's go and um, see if we can do this again. Build another hatchery. Hopefully, it's going to work this time. Uh, let's go and have a look. Uh, okay. So let's go for the hydrolisks uh, once more. Our forces are under attack. You require more minerals. Still waiting for the minerals here. Our forces are under attack. Uh, let's just have a quick look at the upgrades here. Uh, faster Zergling movement. We've also got uh, upgraded missile attacks, which would be good. Uh, let's upgrade the ca carapace, first of all, and just make them a little bit tougher. Let's keep going with the Hydralis. I'm running out of um, money again. Um, this is still still waiting to get mutated there. Um, okay, so everything's going pretty slowly, but that's the best uh, we can do for now. Uh, let's just build up a, a sizable force here of um, hydrolisks and hopefully that will be good enough to push through. Looks like there's a bit of a choke point here, but it should be okay. I wonder if we can get defilers. Oh, there's a... What's he doing there?
Okay, so I'm just going to wait for the carapace upgrades. Um, I wonder if we can actually get defilers here. Um, do we have the buildings for that? What do we have? We've got the queen's nest and the spire as well. Fast overlord movement. We are doing the upgrade over here with the carapace, so I'm just going to wait for that. Uh, we do have a third group now as well. I wonder if this is going to be enough to actually push through um, to the side disruptor. Uh, let's just get um, this going a little bit faster, get some gas here as well. Now over on this side, oh, this is going so slowly. Right, let's just more, get a few more drones out here. Our forces are under attack. God, it's just a oh my god. That's nasty. This is this is a nasty choke point here. I can't get them through, I can't get them up this ramp. That's just awful. There we go. Finally took out the bunker. Gotta get um Oh, he's just going for it. <laughs> he's going for it. Where is this side disruptor? Where is it? I can't see it. I don't know where it is. He's going to die out here, but come on. Where's the side disruptor? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, that's it there. He's not going to survive, but uh, he'll do some damage to it. Uh, we, we got absolutely hammered here. Um, that choke point was just tragic. That was horrible choke point there, trying to get up. Uh, let's just go and build a few more hydralisks. Now, there were two ramps that we had to navigate, and at the top there was a bunker with um, a bunch of tanks and a goliath and, and some Terran marines as well, so that was a pretty terrible... Uh, well, it's good, it's good for them, but we've only, only got a few hydralisks left. Uh, at least I do know where the, um, the side disruptor is now. It's going to be a little bit tough. I guess we can just make a rush for it once we have the uh, the hydralisks. Uh, so let's keep on building the um, building the hydralisks here, going for the upgrades. I guess upgrade the missile attacks. Um, just bring them out over there. I should send the set the rally point out over there somewhere as well. Okay, it feels like a, quite a slow mission here, but we're at least uh, we've we found out where the side disruptor is, and uh, once we have the units, I'm just going to push straight through and uh, see if we can take it out. It's got about 1,500 health. Um, I w really would like the hydro oh, release. Where are we getting attacked from here? Is there a tank over there or something? Our forces are under attack. Attack over here. Just take, take him out. My forces are under attack.
There's the barracks there. Might as well, might as well take out this barracks. There's quite a few of them though. Quite a few marines here. Oh, they just, they just keep coming, don't they? Oh my god, so many of them. All right, let's see if we can take out this barracks. Um, just push up a little bit here. So many marines. They're like they're like Zerg. They're like the Zerg. There's just so many of them. Uh, okay, let's keep going. Let's grab them up here and uh, see if we can make a push to the uh, the side disruptor very very soon. Still waiting for the uh, the hydrolysts to make their way here. It's quite a large map as well. Now we're getting attacked here, are we? Okay, we snuck around some units. Uh, let's keep going with the hydrolysts. We are out of this being gas now as well. Uh, let's go and send these hydrolysts just to take out those tanks. Okay, I have sent some troops to deal with with this, but it's just it's such a large map. It's going to take them a long time to get there. Okay, let's um running out of uh, let's just wait for the oh gosh, they're really pushing up, aren't they? I did, didn't want them to push up. I should have had them just uh, holding their their line there. It's okay. Uh, the upgrade is almost complete. Once that's ready, I think I'll push through and see if we can take out the side disruptor. We don't need to destroy the entire base. Um, we just need to take out the side disruptor, and that should be it. All forces are under attack. Okay. Well, the tank managed to destroy all of the drones there. Let's just cause a bit of havoc here. Um, send them through, cause a bit of a distraction, and Sending a few drones, not quite sure why. Um, it's okay. Okay, we finally made it to the side disruptor. That felt like a quite a long mission there. We're getting attacked by this tank, but uh, we've managed to take that out as well. Uh, the hydrolysts should do their job. It's almost been destroyed. 100 health left. Whew! 